Hello everybody, welcome back to the Rod Squad channel. Nick here with you with Danielle. Uh, and we're on the road right now to go see Don Broco at the Opera House in Toronto, one of our favorite bands uh, of all time. We love Don Broco, right? Yes. They're our absolute favorite. Uh, so I, I've seen them live before. This is Danielle's first time seeing Don Broco live. Uh, and for sure you're getting into the circle pit, right? When like Rob starts uh, starts the circle pit up, you're totally gonna get in there and start moshing, right? A thousand percent with my yeah. glasses on. Um, <laughs> Those aren't gonna get messed up at all with the heels that I'm wearing as well. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna be right in there. Yeah, start moshing, start crowd surfing, and all that good stuff. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, we're super excited. We're on our way uh, to Toronto to go see them at the Opera House. So, first time seeing Don Broco. They have four albums. Uh, which songs are you wanting them to play the most? Uh, so, absolutely no doubt, Uber. They know y'all not on the call, Uber. <laughs> That song just like fucking rocks. Um, sorry, pardon my. Uh oh, French. yeah, you can, you can swear on YouTube, it's okay. <laughs> um, so, Uber for sure. Uh, Manchester, no doubt. Yeah. That song just rips my face. Mm -hmm. um, and then, really looking forward to maybe something off of priorities like Whole Truth. That'd be awesome. Like, Deep cut, an, yep. older, an, older, an older tune. Yep. Something not as new. So, just right off the bat, I want to hear everything, but um, those three in particular. I would like to hear uh, Money, Power, Fame. That would be cool. From Automatic, I'd like nice to choice. hear uh, Come Out to LA. Things are going great. Sun is always shining. Everyone's excited. Um, so yeah, I'd love to hear Come Out to LA and I would love to hear Technology. Yeah, Technology is definitely up there. So yes, Technology would be really good. And uh, I'm just looking forward to seeing them uh, for the first time in four years, the, the last time I saw Don Broco was before the pandemic. So this is going to be awesome to see them now that concerts are back. We tried oh. to see Don Broco. Right. We tried. I forgot about that. That was horrible. The last time we went to go see them was opening up for The Used with Pierce the Veil at Echo Beach in Toronto. We went to the show. Uh, we were so excited. That was supposed to be your first time seeing them. We were so excited. Mm -hmm. And then the weather got bad. And then what happened? We all got migrated to the uh, Budweiser stage because it had an awning and we had to wait there and when we were allowed to go back out to the beach area, um, Don Bronco came on stage and said they had good news and bad news, asked us if we wanted the good news or the bad news first. <laughs> and of course the bad news was because of the rain, their set got cancelled and we were absolutely Devastated. Devastated. I think that's a good word for it. A little bit drunk, but also devastated. Oh, yeah. Like, I, yeah, I was like, well, I'm trash for nothing now. Yeah, exactly. So that was fun. Uh, but now we're actually going to go see them for real. Hopefully they didn't cancel the show in between us uh, doing this video. I would legit cry. Toronto. I would yeah, I, cry. I would legit cry. I'd still buy a t shirt, but I'd still cry. Hurry up, traffic. We're trying to get to Don Broco. Manchester Super Rats, number one fan! Manchester Super Rats, number one fan! Take a
pretty boy looking over. Pretty girl guessing for it. Pretty things can be evil. Pretty tough to avoid. Canada than Toronto, we do know that. So I want to shout out everyone who traveled in, who made, who made some fucking arrangements. We would love to come back one day and do a proper tour here, but we fucking appreciate every one of you who has been working here. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, for sure. Yep, just saying. <laughs>